today's lesson, we're going to be creating our own optical artwork, or op art. Op art is a form of artwork that creates an illusion of space or movement. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Follow along in the video and let's get started. Op art was primarily explored by two artists, Victor Vasali, a French-Hungarian artist who painted his paintings in high contrast colors, and Bridget Riley, who painted her op art in black and white. For our optical illusion, we're gonna create some cylindrical tubes that run across the page. For this project, you'll need some colored pencils or twisties, a black cokey and an A4 piece of paper. To start your project, fold your paper in half horizontally. On the midway line, draw a shallow wave going up and down. You're going to need six reference points or six dots on that wave. You can use two or three fingers at a time to measure out. Create loops on your page by joining the reference points together. In order to create a thin tube, use a narrow loop. In order to create a thick tube, use a fat loop. Add color to your tubes by alternating the colors on your tube. Pay special attention to the tone that you are using to create the optical illusion. Press harder on the outside of the tube and lighter on the inside of the tube so that it looks round. Well, I had fun today creating my own op art. I certainly hope you did as well. There are many tutorials on the internet where you can create different kinds of op art. Go have a look at them and have fun creating some more op arts. I'm going to see you in next week's episode.